everybody, my name is Spam Wolves, and welcome to the end of month vlogs. The thing we do at the end of the month where we look back at the games we've played, have a little talk about them, see how we feel. Now time has passed, and so without any more stalling, let's begin! January 2020, new year, new me, or not, apparently. I started with Britannic. It was something, wasn't it? It looked very pretty on the surface, but that's where it ended. No substance, no soul, no integrity, no quality. It, it's just a thing that exists. Exists, and it's kind of filling a niche little hole for people that don't want to play Roblox and are impatient for honor and glorious Britannic thing coming out. So that was a thing we did. Didn't think much of it. No. Would I play it again? No. Would I recommend it? No. Love to start the year on a high. <laughs> Moving on. After that was Sea of Thieves, and this was a stream highlights, and this is how we're going to be doing them going forwards. I stream over on twitch.tv forward slash bamboos. It's amazing. We're going to be doing a lot of Sea of Thieves. We already have been doing a lot of Sea of Thieves, and when good stuff happens, I'm pulling it into a video, and you're seeing it here on YouTube, so you can get the meat of the matter without having to wait for the whole thing to happen. Still have a lot of love for Sea of Thieves. I really want to be more involved in that community, really do. So 2020, let's see if we can't make that happen. After that was Stormworks. Stormworks continues as it inevitably always does. I still have a lot of joy for Stormworks and the community inside of it is really inspiring. The workshop there is so alive and healthy with new content adding every single day. It's because of that very reason that I don't see us ending Stormworks anytime soon. I've really, really come to appreciate it an awful lot. In fact, I'm going to probably do a video simply saying thank you to the community for their contributions to that game. So good job, Stormworks. Good job. Oh, my God. Reddit review. I don't remember this. Oh, was this a Sea of Thieves Reddit review? I think it was. I've totally got put off doing Reddit reviews now. I was really enjoying doing them and I really thought it was going to be a thing I would always like at least do once a month. But then this whole thing happened with this media publishing company called Junkin Media. They're this company that chases down viral videos and gets the rights to use them and then comes after people like me and then it tries to extort money out of us. It's horrible. Because of that very reason, I don't want to touch them anymore because I'm really worried about having junk in media coming down my back. Yeah. Boohoo! Anyway, moving on. So we do some more Stormworks and then Jedi Fallen Order. Star Wars, it begins. I intended to start the year with this, but it kind of got delayed and pushed back until then. It's going to be a long game and it's going to take the whole month and a little bit extra to get through. But we're sticking to it. We're committing. Initially, I was really worried about how it was being received. Views were kind of not so healthy, but I've come to realize it's going to be the type of video that just kind of sizzles and it slowly grows over time. They're longer videos. People haven't got time to be checking back every single day. That's fine. As long as people are enjoying it, I'm, I'm totally happy to put it out, you know? The game itself is really good. I'm honestly having a blast in that game. The story is really interesting. Visuals, stunning. Sound design, amazing. Like, good job EA. I've never said that. Now do it again. Like, stick to this and don't go back to your dirty old ways or we're going to have fisty cuffs. We do more Stormworks. We do more Jedi Fallen in order. And then will you push the button? I enjoy this game. I enjoy every game I play. That's why I play them. Apart from that Britannic one. I hope that you can also enjoy the more simpler games, such as Will You Push The Button, Would You Rather, and stuff like that. It's really relaxing for me to not have to worry about, you know, doing these big games, doing these long recording sessions, and kind of all this deep editing of the audio and stuff like that. Whether Will You Push The Button or whatever, they're so simple to film. It gives me a break, you know? So Jedi Fallen Order continues. Stormworks does another, another video. Of course it does. Uh, Jedi Fallen Order again. More Sea of Thieves! I should really add more details because I don't remember what episode this was. I think this was, this was me ma making a husband friend. So then we have more Jedi Fallen Order. More Stormworks. And that's, that's the theme for this month. Jedi Fallen Order and Stormworks with a smeckling peckling of other things that are not thems. And then we come to Not For Broadcast. I tried out the demo for this and I was loving it. Absolutely loving it. A really unique, really special kind of game and I just had to play it. It came out on the 30th, so I got in contact with Tiny Build Games, the publishers of the game, and I was like, Oi, give me a review copy! And they're like, okay! Woo. It was really fun. 
It had some annoying angles to it that I didn't quite like, such as the telephone guy and the sound of the clicking of the button. But besides that, it was really wacky and funny and unexpected. I love the idea that I control the camera and if someone's mouthing off, I can cut to that and expose them to the nation. But then during some of the interviews, some really bizarre things happened that questionable if it's going to be monetized or not at this point i've parked it for now i want to see the reaction from you guys if you want to see more of it and if you do there's a little bit more to the game that we can still do so there could be a part two but for now we're gonna wait and see and that brings us to the end of my vlog hooray you survived the whole month so how am i feeling i don't know i've had a really mixed january i started it really i invigorated and empowered like this is it my year i'm gonna do amazing this year we're gonna get this going and i feel like i've already messed up i i perpetually feel like i'm failing i wanted to return to seven day a week uploads but i failed to do that we're still only doing monday to friday uploads i did miss like the friday the 10th from thursday the 16th but i did crowbar in um, a saturday and a sunday to make up for those two missed days so we did okay like we got all the videos out that were really pro blah, 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 blah. that were promised for the most part they're publishing on time some of them were a couple of hours after the 5 p.m i tried to aim for i need to do better i will do better i am doing better my patreon peoples out there i've already given them a roadmap deep dive of kind of what i want to achieve this year and we're still in the, the ballpark to achieve these things i guess it doesn't help that i'm not speaking publicly about it because you haven't got a clue what i'm talking about become a patreon today for as little as one dollar and you can get inside the information Hi! let's just say january i'm happy with the videos i did but i'm not happy with myself in the slightest so coming up in february i'm gonna be a much better human being <laughs> why am i laughing at that so what is happening in February? What can we expect to see on the channel? Well, we're going to be finishing Star Wars. That's a given. There's a possibility of a bonus episode and not the broadcast. That's a thing. Besides that, I don't really know. The end of the month is always the busiest time for me. Getting the videos done, that's granted. But then going into the next month, I need to kind of recoup bonus time so that I can make sure that I'm keeping an eye on what new games are coming in so that I can generate a list of like, well, these are the games that I'm interested in playing. Here's the new games. What do we want to cover? Because there's only so much time to do these. I haven't had a chance to do that at all, really. To be honest, for January, Besides Jedi Fallen Order, I didn't really have a plan. I was just winging it this time, and that's not like me. I never really wing it. Maybe one or two days, but not an entire month. You're going to have to watch this space to see what's happening in February. Anyway, that's going to be an episode for today. This is probably quite a shorter episode. Jedi Fallen Order took up quite a lot of the uploads, and, well, there's only so much we can talk about that. I hope you enjoyed this month. What was your favorite video? Please tell me down below. I would love to know. Also, if you have any game suggestions, jump over to the spammers discord we've got a suggestion feature there i will be checking it out very soon to get some feedback for february and stuff like that to so do it now and if you want to support the channel we've got the t-shirts they're amazing city 17 online it's incredible but also big shout out to patreon january is really hard on creators all the ad revenue on youtube just disappears so it's really hard this month you know to get bills paid and stuff like that but it's my beloved patreons that really help soften the blow so if you would like to become a patreon that would be amazing i would love your face extremely a lot for that and finally if you follow me on twitter that would be cool <laughs> and on that bombshell, thank you for watching. Rate, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next episode. Goodbye, everybody.